Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check your router history on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, on your iPhone, the easiest way to connect to the router is first head into your settings, and then right next to Wi-Fi, let's tap on your Wi-Fi network, and right to the right of there, let's tap on the little I. This will show you your Wi-Fi network, and if I scroll down, we're going to copy the router IP address and connect directly to the router. So tap on the IP address here and hit copy, and then just open up a web browser, and we're going to hit paste and go. This will allow me to connect to my router, make any kind of settings adjustments, see all of the network, and of course, see the history. So you can see I have AT&T fiber internet, depending on what you have, it will look a bit different. But let's go over and I'm gonna tap on diagnostics here. And then I'm gonna tap on logs. Now, once I'm in logs, it will show every single incoming and outgoing IP addresses. Basically, these are various websites or apps or anything that your router has connected to either incoming, downloading, as in viewing websites, apps, all that stuff, or uploading, as in uploading videos, stuff to Google Drive, stuff to you know Facebook, anything like that. Now on here, you can see the source IP address and the destination IP address. You'll see that unfortunately it doesn't show you the URL, but you can always use that IP address and then just copy it and paste it into Google to backtrack what specific service uses that IP address. And from there, you'll be able to get a good sense of the history on any websites that were visited, again, apps that were used, or anything basically that you've uploaded to Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Google Drive, anything like that. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.